42 versus 22. Oh, 42 versus 22. But this is the people robbed and spoiled. They are of them snared in holes and like a, the book of Isaiah 42 verse 22. But this is the people robbed and spoiled. They are of them snared in holes. And who people have robbed and spoiled and steer in all. They be not trapped. Because yo, when they look in our prison holes, who full them up, man? Our people have full up the prison holes, man. So they put them in a trap. They steer them. Read. And they are hid in prison houses. They are for a prey and none delivered for a spoil. Our people are for a prey, man. And none of them, nobody now deliver them, man. None of them now say, yo, when I got chosen people, go back and serve on the Father. All of them want to do is hold on with people in a buffoonery line and tell them, say, I'm a black man, I'm a black woman, and dump them down and have them in a all kind of foolish man. Right? Read what we have. This is Isaiah 59 and 15. Yea, the truth faileth, and he that departed from evil maketh himself a prey. And whoa, 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 whoa. Wait till the truth fail it. And he that depart from evil make himself a prayer. Right now, we depart from evil. So right now, come like we are prayer for evil man them. But you wanna? We are gonna stand up our foot and we are gonna walk on in a righteousness. If you want to come through it, come through it. Because the Lord just said, a thousand shall fall at thy side, and ten thousand at thy right hand. And none can trouble with. Right? Because what? The Lord is with us. And we don't scare. We don't afraid people. Right? We stand up with might. And we attack rough and rugged. Read. And he saw that there was Slakia. Yea, the truth faileth, and he that departed from evil make it himself a prey. And the Lord saw it. And it this, uh, this pleased him that there was no judgment. And he And it is this this pleased them because there was no judgment, man. Because what? Right now, when we look around, man, we see who people them. There's no judgment that they hurt. There's no righteous judgment that they hurt. All the judgment that they hurt is buffoonery and lies. Right? No righteous decree that they hurt. So we are dealing with righteousness, man. And true, we are dealing with righteousness. They want to rush us. But when they come, because the Lord is going to defend us with a mighty hand. And he saw that there was no man. And one day that there was no intercessors. Therefore his arm brought salvation unto him. His arm brought salvation unto him, man. Without Yahweh, Shimei, and Shai, there is no salvation. Right? And that's why, yo, we are trying to stand up in our might right now. And we are bringing forth the word to our brothers and sisters. Whether they're here or whether they're from here. We're doing our job. Yo, we're not force feeding nobody, you know. That's right. Because, yo, at the end of the day, man, we don't come out here to tell nobody, say, yo, listen, may I teach you this and may I persuade this down your throat. Like, ah, we come to talk and listen, the Lord do the rest. The Lord ignite you, the Lord get the understanding, and the Lord are going to raise you up. Because, you know, if this does not resonate with you, you can't get it. So the Lord may be not working with you, but once this resonates with you, brothers and sisters, remember me tell you, take in and start to do the Lord work. Because, yo, all we have is truth. And the truth is of the Lord. And it, the Lord do what? Encourage us. The Lord say what? Have our what? strong mind. The Lord say. Have courage. Have faith. And we have courage and we have faith. And that's why we stand up in a loose sham. And we stand up with might. And we are doing the Lord work. So if you're not an Israelite, this is not for you. Shame on you. You're born upon the wrong bloodline. Right? So we deal with the Israelite. If you're an Israelite, the praise is here for you. So you need to come over to the way of the Heavenly Father so you can seek understanding. And when you seek understanding, you shall do it. Be ye doers of the word and not hearers only. Read the way of King. Psalms 91, verse 11. For he shall give his angel charge over thee. What did the Lord say? For he shall give his angel charge over thee. The Lord shall give his angel charge over thee, man. Right? Because what? At the end of the day, man, the Lord of angels, you know, and these angels when the Lord have, they're not coming around here to come and play with people. 
If you're not doing anything for the Lord, the angel coming to butcher you. That's right. Right. Get it to your head. I know what I feel like a joke we are making. We can't know scripture. Right? I'm going to give you the book of um, give me Psalms chapter 34 and start at 7. And a man give me Syrac chapter 39 and start at 28, man. Right? But give me Psalms chapter 34, 7 first. 34 and 7. And 7. The angel of the Lord encamp him round about them that fear him. What the Lord say? The angel of the Lord encamp him round about them that fear him. We fear the Lord. An angel is round us. But we can't see them. Because what? And the Lord angel them. The Lord makes some people when liquidize. You can't see them. Those are the angels of the Lord. And they encamped it round about us. Right? And that's why we're out there. We're busy with people. And if you want to know your judgment, come ask question, man. I will give it to you. Right? Read on, King. And deliver it them. Oh, taste and see that the Lord is good. What, sir? Oh, oh taste, taste and see that the Lord is good. I know you taste and see that the Lord is good. Read the scripture. Come to the book. Because you will read it and it fly over your head and you do not understand what you read. So you know what? The Lord always set up men to teach you, right? So you can understand. That's why the scripture said, do you know what you're reading? And when Philip said, how can I know unless a man guide me, right? So you need guidance when you're reading this Bible because this Bible is not a fiction book, right? This Bible is like a spider web. It's like a maze, precept and precept. Line upon line, here a little deer, over the salicle. That's how the Bible read, man. Right. right? Read, King. Blessed is the man that trusted in him. Oh, fear the Lord, ye his saints, for there is no one to them that fear him. There is no one to the children of Israel that fear Yahweh and Shimei and Shai. But we have a lot of children of Israel, they not fear the Heavenly Father. That's, That's right. why they want. Because right. what? All of them want to, oh, I feel like, oh, uh, that, that's not for me, fam. I can't bother with the shouting thing, fam. What kind of shouting, fam? I ain't going on the road to shout, fam. Listen, man, I'm coming out here. Because the Lord sent me out here. Me fear the Lord. So, yo, the Lord not going to make me want nothing, right? Nothing too great for me. The Lord not going to make me have, right? Because what? I am being obedient unto my father until death. That's right. Right? No, what me ask her now? What me ask her? And what's your, what's your next one? Come on. Ecclesiastes. Ecclesiastes. 39, verse 28. There be spirits that are created for vengeance. What did the Lord say? There be spirits that are created for vengeance. The Lord creates spirit that created for vengeance. So when you see a guy down the road, lie down dead, and the guy will kill it, gone. The Lord put that spirit upon that guy for good time. That's right. And then go away. That's because right. Because your day coming when they're going to hold you and put you in the coop. Right? Read. <laughs> Which in their fury lay on source strokes. It said they are spirit that created for vengeance. Which in their fury lay on source strokes. You ever get a cut? And something rub against it. Sore strokes. Right? That's how the Lord worked, man. Read. In the time of their destruction, they pour out their forces. So in the time when the Lord said, listen, go start the service there. You have a spirit where is a fire. Him go start him service. You have a spirit where is wind. Him come start him service. That's how the Lord worked. High scripture, we are reading them. The son of my own mind. Read, King. And a peace. The wrath of him that made them. So the, it, the spirit pleased the wrath of the Lord that made them. Read. Fire. What, sir? Fire. 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 Fire is a spirit of the Lord. That's Read. right. And hail. And what? And hail. 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 You know them big hail. What time right. they come out of the sky? They broke out here out. Read. Read. Right. And famine. And what? And, and famine. So when you see the world right now fall and the world place dry up and get glad dead and the Lord will kill them. Right? Because these spirit created for vengeance of the Lord. That's Anybody right. Anybody got the right? The Lord say, you know what? Right now over there in Ethiopia, everything are dead. Right? 
Because what? Famine not the land. The land has fixed them. Because what? They disappear and they disrespect the Lord's children. Everybody who disappear and disrespect the Lord's children, the Lord has fixed them. No matter think I drop me a man, I say it up. So when you read the book of Jeremiah chapter 30, verse 16, get that to my Read. And death and all these were created for vengeance. When the Lord said death, all these was created for vengeance. Read our king, more upon that enough. Teeth of wild beasts. Wait, sir. Teeth of wild beasts. So when one lion grab one down in and you have one the teeth of wild beasts are when I venture as well as creator. Read. Read. Teeth and scorpions. And what? And scorpions. So when a scorpion bite to the teeth, you know, and the Lord vengeance, he might fix you know, because yo, the Lord now have come down here and I say, hey, Banyamian, you're not doing good enough. You know. I'm going to come and I'm going to kick you all over the place. The Lord say, you know what? Let me get either my Esau and send him to go fix Banyamian. And then you see either my Esau come, hold me and fix me. I told me now, please the Lord, say fix me. Right? But once me I do the Lord will, the Lord is gonna make me all right. Because the Lord said in that Proverbs 16, verse 7, when a man ways please the Lord, he make even the enemy to be at peace with him. Right? Read. Serpents and the sword punishing the wicked to destruction. It's a serpent and the sword punishing the wicked to destruction, man. All these things are the vengeance of the Lord. Right? So when certain things come upon us, why me? Why not you? You doing anything for the please the Lord? Oh Lord, why me? Me say, why not you? When last you do something for the Lord? No, 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 no for the Lord. Everything about me, 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 me. Why not you feel that? Why not you not feel that? The Lord will put you on the man. The Lord will take you now and take back his spirit out on the body. Right? God and I do not be pleased for Father. Read. They shall, re they shall rejoice in his commandments and they shall be ready upon earth. Yeah, yeah, lad. All these spirit or rejoice when the Lord give them the work. When it's a fire, chop in America and burn out the whole of California. Here comes the wildfire. Oh, it's been burning for the last three months. <laughs> when it dropped in Australia, oh, the wall of Perth burning down. Lord of mercy, what's going on? The Lord are burning out because the wicked are evil. Right? But we're not doing nothing for please the Father. Read on, King. And when their time has come, they shall not transgress his word. So when the time comes, when the Father send them out, them Lord say, Lord, I'm not going to burn down California. Lord, I'm not going over there to burn up Australia. I love that place so much. I'm not burning it, Lord. They have to go because the Lord give them strict commandment and say, listen now, I'm ready for you. So you go burn down anyway, me tell you if you go burn down. And when he tell the hill, come out of the sky and buck down when they drop down. None of them can't say them now go. They must be ready for do what the Lord say, man. That's right? right. Read. Therefore, from the beginning, I was resolved and thought upon these things and have left them in writing. The Lord resolved these things and thought upon these things and left them in writing. That's why these words are here, faithful and true. Because what? The Lord said, when the, when the Lord said in um, the book of Romans, Romans chapter 15 verse 4, it says, these things are written for our learning. Right. So we have to learn the scripture and take it to the T. If you're not an Israelite, drop dead. Right? Read on King. Verse 33, all the works of the Lord are good, and he will give every needful thing in due season. All the works of the Lord are good, and he will give all needful things in due season. That's right. So anything what we say, what we want, from you doing the Lord charge, he will let us have it, man. That's right. We just have to have faith and be contender for the Lord, man. That's right. Never, ever foul, go backwards from the heavenly Father charge. Bring it out. Keep it. Do it, children of Israel. Right? Read. So that a man cannot say, This is worse than that. For in time they shall be, they shall be well approved. And therefore, praise thee the Lord with the whole with thine own heart and mouth. And bless the name of the Lord. 
So we give praises unto the Heavenly Father. Call you all the Hawa. Bashem Yahushai. Bashem We are going to praise the Heavenly Father. So till the break the left in my body, man. That's because right. What? At the end of the day, this is the only way we can have prosperity around here. Look how people them. All when them want to dress up and look like a mannequin. Might as well go turn up in a one store. That's right. Move. That's right. You understand? Because yeah. none of them not in the world. But please the Father, man. All of them want to come out there and do with them, please. Defile them temple, walk around and bring them with sister them. And with sister them, walk around there and do with them, please. And take themselves and tilt up, turn all kind of foolery, man. Right? I put on all kind of long finger nail, long high lash, right? I put on new body, I put on new breast, <laughs> and they can't get the new front. <laughs> who want to get new front too? That's right. And who want to get two, no only one, <laughs> right? Wait, over there, over there. This is Matthew. This is Matthew 24, verse 6. And ye shall hear of wars and rumors of wars. See that ye be not troubled. For all these things must come to pass, <laughs> but the end is, is not yet. All these things has to come to pass, man, but the end is not yet. Because what? At the end of the day, man, yo, the Lord said, He that endure to the end, right? Give me, give me the, give me, yeah, boy, why not? Give me revelation. For a nation shall rise against nation. For a nation shall rise against nation. And kingdom against kingdoms. Nation shall rise against nation. Sister, we're looking forward to see you again, yeah? Lord willing. Right? You have a good day, yeah? Alright, shalom, sister. She said, nation shall rise against nation. Kingdom against kingdom, man. Right? Read. And there shall be famines and pestilence and earthquakes in diverse places. And all of these things are the vengeance of the heavenly Father create, man. That's so right. bring it down for the people and when them now nah, up here in words, man. Right? So that's why we are taking heed and we are doing the work of our Father in truth and sincerity. Right? Not half hearted, full hearted. Right. We now hold back. Read. All these are the beginning of sorrows. Then shall they deliver you up to be afflicted. They are going to come and they are going to deliver we up. Even more people that we had. So it's not me. See that? This Panyam man. Take him and go on. He make me life hard. He make everybody I look down for me. Right? Because what? All these things we are going to be afflicted, man. And we feel good. We feel when we get afflicted for our father. Because we are going to jump for joy. Because the Lord said, man, yo. Or oh, oh, read that king. They shall be delivered to you. Slack here. They shall be delivered you up to be afflicted and shall kill you. And ye shall be hated of all nations for my name's sake. They are going to kill us and we are going to be hated of all nations for the Lord's sake. Because we are out here right now. And we are out here with truth. And look, all nations, them can't take how we are dealing with. Because why? At the end of the day, man. We are dealing righteousness. That's right. So them why we keep on living a lie. This is the worst place me ever live. Because I see one big fat woman. And them say me can't say she fat. Why? Because they want me to tell lie. She big and fat, she didn't have too much. You understand? Right. So at the end of the place, they want to tell me, say, Ah, you're being rude. How oh, me you being rude? If you're big and fat, man, you're big and fat. I see one big fat man. I say, yo, bigger. The man has said me not to call him bigger. I <laughs> see one big fat one, them say him name tiny. Mr. Man, I opposite that man, my name bigger. You understand? No, over there, over there. No, read Jeremiah. Jeremiah 30, verse 16. Therefore, all that that devour thee shall be devoured, and all thy adversaries, every one of them shall go into captivity. So all of them who devour the children of Israel shall be devoured. And all of our adversary, because the heavenly father said we have enemy. Right. So me no come round and come talk about me love everybody. If the Lord said me have enemy, I am looking for them, and them are my enemy. That's right. Me no come round and come beg my enemy friend. Me come to tell my enemy say I'm my enemy. And listen, man, we are put him on the ground, and we are walk on him neck, just like what Joshua said. Get all these kings and put them down, and make a trap on them neck. Right? Read on, king. And they that spill thee shall be spoiled, and all that prey upon thee 
who I came for a prayer. And all of these people that pray upon us and have us working from sun up to sundown, the Lord said, He might go give them for a prayer unto us. Because yo, we need justice. Right? Because for far too long, we people have not get no justice. So right now, the Lord has sent me out here to put the record straight to make what people them know say there's hope coming on the way. Read on King. For well, I will restore health unto thee, and I will heal thee of thy wounds, except the Lord. The Lord said, I'm going to help, restore health unto thee, and I'm going to cure us and we wound. Because of how we wounded, man, we bat and bruise up, man, right? So we are looking for the Heavenly Father for cure we, man, and heal us and be our remedy. Because if it's not of the Heavenly Father, there's no remedy here for us, man, right? Whether you don't believe it, yes or no, man, right? What are you there? Go back to the sun. Where you are, That's it. This is Psalms chapter 34, verse 16. The face of the Lord is against them that do evil to cut off the remembrance of them from the earth. The face of the Lord is against them that do evil to cut off the remembrance of them Get from out. the earth, man. Right? Because what? Our people them do too much evil. So the Lord said, I'm going to cut off the remembrance of them from the earth. This is serious thing, you know, man. Imagine that. The Lord said, I'm going to cut off the remembrance of them from the earth. So it's like our forefathers on the earth. And after our forefathers on the earth, the thing is this. They was doing good. So what? The Lord left a memory of them here. Right? But the wicked, no memory now go left of them. It's like they wasn't here. Because the Lord said say what? He might go take what them spirit, man. And him now make them come back in the earth. Right? They might go cut out. No memory now go left of them. Read on. The righteous cry and the Lord hear him. And deliver them out of all their troubles. When we cry to the Lord, man, he might go hear we, man. And he might go deliver us from out of our trouble. Because your trouble is coming, children of Israel. That's right. Don't feel like the trouble now come. Right? Give me Revelation chapter 2 and start at uh, 25. Sister. Sister. That's it. Revelation. Revelation chapter 2 and verse 25. But that which ye have already hold fast till I come. We are going to hold fast by fast, the heavenly father we are, until he come man. Because yo, he said when he give us already, he give us the scripture, he give us the last touch and commandment. So he might talk to us plain. That's right. He said that what you have already man, yam yam, yakaza. Right? Hold fast until me come. Read. Right. I need that overcometh and keep with my word unto the end. To him will I give power over the nation. And we're going to keep this word to the end, man. Because what? We want power over the nation. Before too long, we don't know what power look like, man. So we want to have power over the nation. So when we have power over the nation, we are going to look for them and we are going to call them. And we are going to put them at them place. Right. right. And make them know, say, yo, your time is up, man. So listen, you have some big brick for lift up, lift up man. Uh, and if them uh, say them can't lift them up, man, yo. May I throw a lick, man? They might have to go find strength. Oh, yes. It need to go up. Right. It need to lift up. And yo, uh -huh. they might have to find strength to lift it up, man. Because yo, we was working hard. And nobody never said why. Listen, you have enough. No, they was pushing more work. Uh -huh. So why should we come and feel like so we are playing ease up? There's no ease up, man. Pressure. I'm going to come down upon them. Right. Sister. Excuse me. Excuse me. Where you from? Read on, King. Psalms 91, verse 14. Because he has set his love upon me, therefore will I deliver, therefore will I deliver him. I will set him on I, because he has known my name. The Lord said, we set our love upon him. So he's going to deliver us. Because what? We know that Yahweh and Shimei and Shai is our savior. He's our protector. Right? He our shield, our rock, our hiding place. So we right. set our love upon the Lord. So Lord willing, the Lord can do it. Comfort us and build us up. 
right to the pinnacle where we put us man so we can get power over all these nations and rule them with a rod of iron right right read he shall call upon me and i will answer him i will be with him in trouble i will deliver him and honor him the lord's gonna deliver us man the lord is gonna honor us man the lord's gonna set us up like in the days of old man right and we can't wait upon this day man Every day we go to bed, we pray, man. That's right. When we wake up, man, we pray, man. Whatever time, man, we pray to the Father, man. Somehow we fast. We try to be on one accord with our power, man. And we ask the Father, take not the Holy Spirit away from us. Right. But increase more faith in us, our Yahweh, Shabbat Shalom. With long life will I satisfy him and show him my salvation. Long life with the Lord satisfy us and show us in salvation, man. Because we need salvation, right? Because what? Before too long, the children of Israel under bondage. And the Heavenly Father, Yahweh Shimei and Shai, He is the one that we have to seek to right now. Give me Isaiah 9 and 6. Isaiah 9 and 6. Proverbs chapter 8, verse 34. Blessed is the man that heareth me, watching daily at my gates. So the Lord said, Blessed are the man and the woman that heareth him, man, and watch daily at his gate. We pray and pray and send supplication unto the heavenly Father. Right. Daily and pray for the Lord to give us strength, man. For the Lord to give us power over this nation. Because, yo, are we are the children of Israel? Are we are right. Yasharala? Are we are the children with the power? But we have to know how to tap into our power. And the way we tap into our power is to come and read these scripture and read them and be sincere unto our Father. We can't come and be half hearted. We can't come and promote right. yourself with all kind of germs, man. The other nation, we're not supposed to mix and mingle with them. Because the Lord said, we are separated from them. We can't mix and mingle with the so-called, with the, not the so-called, with the ugly red boy. No, because the ugly red boy is a plague unto us. Right. We have to stick by ourselves. We have to love each other. That's right. The Lord said the children of Israel, we are not supposed to mix and mingle with the other nation. When we mix and mingle with the other nation, we call it not a curse by ourselves. It's a trap. And that's why the ugly red boy come here and give me this dog here and say, This is Jesus Christ. Which that is a lie, man. Read up my answer, King. For us, for unto us a child is born, unto us a son is given. The government shall be upon his shoulder. And this is a Mashiach Yahweh man. He was born unto the children of Israel. And the government, the government must rest on him shoulder. Because what? Well, I am our leader. I am our savior. We're not voting for anyone. But I'm not sure I shy. Them right. show a ballot paper through my door. Me kick you out, man. Me throw it in. That's right. Because I'm not voting for anyone else. That's right. But right. my lord. That's right. You understand? I don't come around here to vote for man. Man can't go to hell. Man is nothing but a pimp. Right? I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. And listen. Him lying in pocket and him have free man in front of them and them show up and do what they do. I not unite with them man. I stand up in a mind for my lord man. Yes, Ishmael. And his name shall be called Wonderful, Counselor, the Mighty, Yahweh, the Everlasting Father, the Prince of Peace. And this is who we serve, the Wonderful Counselor, the Mighty Power, Yahweh, Shimei, and Shai. Right? The Prince of Peace. And he is our Saviour. Amashia Kiawashai. Give me Matthew 121. Amashia Kiawashai. Right? He's our Prince of Peace, man. He's our Savior. Right? So at the end of the day, man, children of Israel, we have to turn our foot unto the testimony of Yahweh Shimei and Shai. Right. Because it says, unto us a son is born, man. And who is his son, man? Amashia Kiawashai. Who is our government? Who is our leader? Our king? Our big brother? Read. Matthew chapter 1 and verse 21 And she shall bring forth a son 
Atah shakhu his name, Amashiach, for Yahweh Shai, for he shall save his people. And right now we need to see a man, because what? At the end of the day, man, the Lord said, he going to save his people from their sin, right? And at the end of the day, we people have been sinning for far too long. Give him Matthew 2 and start at 6. We people have been sinning for far too long. So people have not come out of sin and come back to the way of the heavenly father in truth and sincerity. Give me the book of um, Luke chapter 1 and start at 67. <laughs> 